Hi guys, it's Crystal. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I created the Mama Bear in Cricut Design Space that I put on my Dyson. So the first thing you're going to do is start with a blank canvas and then you're going to um, insert an image. Uh, once you get to the images, you're going to type in bear and then all the different bear images is going to come up and you're going to select this one right here and it is free so then the next thing you're going to do is you're going to type an arrow and I chose this one right here and what we're going to do is we're going to slice those arrows so we got them here and we're going to separate them apart so I can slice them so we move the arrows down away from the bear then I'm going to rotate it 180 degrees as you can see here once you get it rotated you are going to insert a shape and you want to select a square this is how we're going to slice so you're going to go ahead and select a square and then you're going to take the square and you're going to move it on top of one of the arrows just one so you're going to perfectly move it over and don't touch the other one all the way where it's completely over it then you're going to um, select the whole thing so then once you get it all selected you're going to come up here and you're going to hit slice once you hit slice it's going to cut those apart so now you're going to exit off and take off the big square so you're going to select that and then you're going to I'm trying to keep up with my time here uh, then you're going to exit that now you have three arrows you moved one down so you're going to exit out of the black one and that's going to leave you with two arrows left now you have your two arrows to work with they're separated so now we're going to resize them. We're going to move them one on top of the bear, one below. We're going to go ahead and take the bottom one and we're going to go ahead and rotate it 180 degrees. Once you get it rotated, now we're going to unlock. If you, you're just going to hit the lock on once you have them highlighted and you're going to stretch them out so that way they can fit over the bear. So that way you can have your perfect arrows. Once you do that, then we're going to add text. So we're going to go ahead and type out mama here. Once we get mama typed out, we're going to change the font to Clo, um, as you can see here. And then once we change it to Clo, you can see so it's more like a cursive. We're going to go ahead and adjust the um, spacing between the letter spacing. And uh, we're going to just push it in just a little bit better so it looks like cursive once you do that you're going to get it to where you want it on your bear and once you have it where you want it, you want to select the whole thing and we're going to attach it all we're going to hit attach so once we hit attach everything's going to change the same color which is perfect so everything's going to be cutting out the same color so once we do that we're going to go ahead and pull it out here resize it and uh, we have it all attached we're going to go ahead and we're going to insert another shape. We're going to insert a square. This is going to be our weeding square. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on the square. Once we got our square there, we're going to go to, uh, you're going to click on a range. Once you click on a range, you're going to move it to the back, the square to the back. And it will put it right behind the bear. So once it's behind the bear, you want to resize it to where it's um, just a little bit outside of the design. And then we're going to um, select all of that and we're going to attach it. And then you're ready to um, print. So you're going to go to go. So once it's select, that's where it's all select and you're going to attach it here. That's where you're going to attach. And then you're going to hit go and you are all ready to go. It's all ready to cut out. Um, this is super easy to, when you put the square behind it, which I'm sure you've seen tons of people do, um, it just helps it. So that way you could go ahead and cut the whole entire 12 by 12 and um, you can just peel off that little piece and that way you don't have to sit there and cut it first. But Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Thanks guys. Have a great day.